eyes down for a moment. Drop the belly. Welcome to my first video for 2022. I feel like so much has changed and I know the past year or last year 2021 I was the worst at uploading and connecting with you guys actually and I feel kind of sad and bad about it but here's a video I hope that we can rekindle our relationship but for today we're starting off nice and easy with a vlog and again like so much has changed I mean like from my hair I don't think I've showed the vlog yet that I got my hair done. It was my first time to get like highlight. It's Saturday 10 35 a.m. and I actually have a bit of stuff to do today. I'm actually attending my friend's wedding today. I'm just going to the church portion of the wedding just because I'm scared to go to the reception but I'm sure it's gonna be fine and safe but then you just never know so I'm just going to the church and see the two lovebirds get wedded. Side note though, I wanted to quickly mention that I actually got a new camera. Mm, let me show you. Wait. There you go. It's white because the black one was out of stock. I got it off of Henry's online and I was actually kind of scared of like buying electronics online but it's fine. The first thing I want to do today though and I think it's apt for a new year video is I need to clean my room. I know that I'm way past the age of showing you guys like how messy my room is right now. I do enjoy watching Clean With Me's. I always play it whenever I clean so let's go do that. If you've been procrastinating cleaning your room and then this is your sign. Let's go clean. Hmm. Step one of cleaning, I just have to pick up some of the things around my room and put them in the right place or right spot. Okay, so I don't have time to mop my floor or wash my bathroom, so I might just do that tomorrow because I'm in a rush. We're just gonna quickly get ready. I washed my hair, so I have to dry it. I don't even have a proper blowout brush, so I'm just gonna dry it however normally. Please don't judge me, I'm not really a hair person, but I'll try my best. Okay, this is the makeup look. I'm not even gonna do anything for my lips because I hate having it stain my mask. Okay, now we're gonna do hair. I don't know what to do with my hair. Quickly, it's 12.25. I was meant to leave the house by 12.30, but I have to take an antigen mask. I need to take an antigen test. This is the outfit. This is the dress. I just got it from SM. When in doubt, just go to SM. It's, I already had this outfit, but it's still like kind of long. Shoes doesn't doesn't really matter since it's hidden. Earrings. These are really cute. I love them so much. I did my nails, but they're kind of bad. I only did one coat. The masks that we're using. Guys, I'm so embarrassing. Like, I really don't know anyone in the wedding. Just the bride and the groom. I only know them. And then I brought my mom. Like, I feel so socially awkward already. Yeah, not yeah. CR okay, we're gonna find the CR. It's a curse or a consequence. But so much I love defense. Good morning guys, it's the next day, so it's gonna be a very lazy Sunday. It's already around 10 
45 I think 10 30 and I just had a very chill and so morning I didn't even stretch or anything I just woke up lied in bed for a bit and had breakfast right away now we're just getting lunch I wanted pasta so we're gonna go to a little cafe and I don't really have any plans obviously just stay at home so you really have to be creative in ways of um, entertaining yourself so I'm gonna list stuff on carousel I have a lot of clothes that I've loved and I'm just ready to let go of a lot of them it's actually really cute they're rainbow <laughs> colors theme so and I'm just gonna sell them for really cheap probably I just want to get rid of them the clutter have some more space in my closet and give new life to some pieces that have been in my closet for a bit or yeah just stuff that I've loved and have cherished so check my carousel out if you want some colorful pieces oh, here's a better look of the outfit we are gonna go and pick up the food Hi, so we finished our Monday morning meeting. It was very nice, just updates. And Monday morning meeting is like the reality check of, oh, what am I gonna do this week? What am I gonna accomplish? And caught up with the team for a bit, which is always really fun. So I did my to-do list and there's just a lot of like little things that I have to do and I'm ready to just crush them and check them off of the list. So that's always very exciting and fun. Um, it's also gonna probably be a very boring video, but I will try to show you some fun little unboxing, like recent pickup sort of thing, which I love watching. Um, I got a text that a Zara order is coming in and guys, I've, I haven't purchased from Zara in a bit It's been maybe two years or three. I don't know. I just haven't really purchased from Zara <laughs> uh, Recently, but they are on sale still I think so I tried ordering online right now I wanted to show you guys the planner that I'm using for this year. So this planner is for my life, um, for work, everything, just normal planning stuff. I'm using the Design Your Life Planner, but it's so cute. I think it's the cutest planner that I've ever owned. The past few years, I've been purchasing just the plain, undated planner, stuff that you can customize fully on your own accord, and even a bit of bullet journaling, right? But I realized that I'm just way too lazy to actually do the setups each month and it's just not something that I super look forward to. Like I don't really enjoy setting out time every week to do the weekly spread. So I just wanted something that was already ready for me. So this is what it looks like. It's super duper cute. First of all, I love how there are all of these tabs that keeps things very nice and organized and easy to see as well as the monthly tabs i think it's so cute every month there's a different theme or color combination let me show you an empty month so this is for january and then fab's like a cafe theme march is just green oh i really like this very cute pastel but minimal it's not too much the designs i think like it's just really fun to see what theme each month has so that's why i picked this one up and i also really like the layout of it i, I really love it when they give you a lot of space for the monthly spread and that it's vertical instead of horizontal so i love this planner i've been using it a lot and yeah sorry that it's kind of the middle of january when i'm showing you my planner but yeah i'm very happy that i picked this one the other planner that i have is this plain black one from cadadia.co on instagram but this one is undated 
and it's the horizontal type of spread which I don't really like for my everyday tasks but I use this for my Devo. I haven't really been on my game. Like it's been a busy weekend for the first time ever. I haven't really been doing my Devo. So you can see I skipped today is Gen 17 and I skipped 15, 16. Yeah, 15 and 16. Cause usually for the big blank uh, pages, I do notes for the Sunday service sermon of the week and I missed it. So I have to watch that later or sometime this week so i'm doing a little work break right now it's 3 15 pm and i thought i'd do a little haul like a quick little haul i'll probably try on the pieces so that you guys can also see what it looks like i haven't done a haul in such a long time on this channel because you guys know how i feel about feeling so overwhelmed when you're like spending money you're like choosing stuff to buy but i'm not gonna lie i really do like fashion dressing up and putting an outfit together and i felt like i needed some more basic pieces in my closet as always I feel like everyone always says that I told you a while ago that I ordered some stuff from the Zara sale online. The first top I got is this neutral basic ribbed tank top. I got this in a size XS to S but I think it runs big because it fits me perfectly. It's not digging into my skin or anything so this was the perfect size for me. This is probably my favorite thing that I got from this haul because of the straps. I think it's very unique and very cool. The next top I got is just a plain black crop top. This one's a lot tinier than the first one I showed you. It's the same size XS to S and it's a seamless black halter top. I just needed a black halter top. For bottoms, I got one of their seamless biker shorts. I don't know why I got it in this color but whatever. Sometimes, you know, I just have a thing for color, you know, and for the longest time, I've always been drawn to color and I've always just purchased color. I don't know where I was going with that, but I just got the ribbed biker shorts. I got this in a size medium large and I could have, I think I could have gotten the small one, but it's fine. Like it's super comfy, stretchy, and soft and opaque. It's really opaque. The last thing I got from the sale is this white skirt. I got this in a size small very thick and it has nice little ruching and buttons on the side for the closure. I think it's really cute. A basic piece. That's everything I got from Zara but I also wanted to show you some stuff that I got from Love Bonito. So just side quanto, this year I've partnered up with Love Bonito. I get to pick out around two to three items per month and I just have to show it on my Instagram. So I don't really have to show this on YouTube but just so that you guys can know and just cuento, I'm just saying it or mentioning it here. I love Love Bonito for their basics. I think Love Bonito is a great place to shop for quality basics. So I was looking for a dark gray pair of trousers. Here is what they look like. Just dark gray, wide leg-ish trousers very cute comfy i was trying to go for a matilda drift moment so it's like i need i need some great trousers i'm a medium in most love bonito items but i still urge you guys to check out the size chart and the measurements for every piece on love bonito because sometimes some things run bigger sometimes things run smaller so just check and then the last staple that i really wanted for the matilda drift look <laughs> is an oversized white polo super big i don't have a but a white button down shirt surprisingly so i got this one i got it in a size extra large because i really wanted the oversized fit those were the two pieces i picked from love bonito okay i have to send an item on grab so brb Hi, I'm back. I just had to, had to send out one of the carousel orders. She booked a Lolo move, so I had to send it out. But as we were saying, the last two pieces are from a local Instagram store called Linao. Lina the label. And their pieces are really cool because they use a local weave called Binacol or Binacol Binac Binacol. I would say Binacol. I don't know. I suck at knowing how to pronounce words, so. I will just say binacol. Uh, I picked out this top. It's super cute. It's like a corset 
style top because at the bottom, see how it uh, is longer in the middle. <laughs> I don't know how to explain. I don't know the terminologies. And it's pretty strappy. There's like three straps um, at the back and a front zipper closure. It's super well made. It's lined, so you're pretty safe. And not gonna lie, I think it's a bit small on me. So I have to like zip it down a bit. And then the last piece they sent is in this nice purple shade, so very peri. And this one's really cute. It's like a, it's just a flap of fabric. Don't you love it when tops are just a flap of fabric? No. So I love it because it's actually not a crop top, so that's great. It's a long shirt, so it covers a lot, but you it's a halter and then you tie it at the back as well. So it's backless halter top. And it's also lined, it's pretty thick, so you don't have to worry about wearing a bra. You can just wear pasties, nipple covers. Actually, I don't even think that you need nipple covers. So those are the new fashion pieces. So that concludes my haul, and I'll see you guys in a bit, I think. Maybe. Who knows? Good morning guys! It's the next day, but here I'm gonna show you all the orders are packed and ready to be shipped. I booked all of the GoGo Expresses last night. I love GoGo Express. It's very convenient and easy to use and reliable, I think. The majority of the clothes have been sold, so that's amazing. I'm very happy about that. And yeah, I just want to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. And this video was from my heart to yours. Bye! <laughs>